when the bot is out, we will drink water and not a drop before. <laughs> Therefore, bear up and boredom. Servant monster, drink to me. Servant monster, folly in a silence. They say there's but five upon the aisle, and we are one, two, three of them. The other two be brains like us, the state totters. Drink, servant monster, when I bid thee. Thy eyes are almost set in thy head. Where should they be set else? He were a brave monster indeed, were they set in his tail. <laughs> My man monster has drowned his tongue in sack. For my part, the sea cannot drown me. Oh. I swam ere I could recover the shore five and thirty leagues off and on by this light. Thou shalt be my lieutenant, monster, or my standard. <laughs> Your lieutenant, if you list, he's no standard. Will not run, monsieur, monster. Nor go neither, yet you'll lie like dogs and say nothing neither. Mooncap, speak for once in thy life if thou beest a good mooncap. Ah, how does thine honor? Oh, let me lick thy shoe. I'll not serve him, he is no valiant. Thou liest, most ignorant monster! I'm, I'm encased to, to just a constable! Oh, thou debauched fish, thou! Was there ever a man who cowed or drank as much sack as I have today? Wilt thou tell a monstrous lie, being but half a fish and half a monster? No, <laughs> how he mocks me! Wilt thou let him, my lord? Lord, quoth he, that a monster could be such a natural! Oh, no, again! Buy him to death, I pretty! Train Kellow, keep a good tongue in thy head. If you should prove a mutineer, the next tree. <laughs> the poor monster is my subject, and he shall not suffer indignity. Thank you, <laughs> my noble lord. Oh. Will thou be pleased to hearken once again to the suit I made to thee? Mary will I kneel and repeat it. I will stand, and so shall Trinculo. Why, as I told thee, I am subject to a tyrant, a sorcerer, that by his cunning hath cheated me of the island. Yeah. Thou liest! Thou liest! Thou yes, the monkey, thou! I would my valiant master would destroy him. I do not lie. Yellow, if you trouble him any more in his tail, by this hand I will supplant some of your teeth. Oh, I said nothing. Mum, then, oh. and no more. Proceed. Why, as I told you, he took this island from me. He, by sorcery, he got this island from me. Me, he got it. If thy greatness would revenge it on him, for I know that thou darest, but that thing dares not. <laughs> That's most certain. <laughs> yeah, thou shalt be the king of thee, and I will serve thee. Uh, how now shall this be compassed? Uh, canst thou bring me to the party? Yeah, yeah. I will him thee asleep where thou mayst knock a nail into his head. Thou <laughs> liest! Thou canst not! What a pining is this, thou scurvy patch! I do beseech thy greatness, give him blows, take his bottle from him. When that's gone, he shall drink not but brine, for I'll not show him where the quick freshes are. Thanks, yellow! <laughs> Run into no further danger. Interrupt the monster one word further, and by this hand, I'll turn my mercy out of doors and make a staff fish of thee. What, what did I? I? I did nothing! Go farther off. Didst thou not say he lied? Yeah. Thou liest! <laughs> <laughs> Do I so? Take thou that! <laughs> As you like this, give me the lie another time! <laughs> I did not give the lie! You're out of your wits and hearing too! The cock's on your bottle! This can sack and drink and do it! I'm gonna rain on your monster and the devil take your fingers! <laughs> Come! 
forward with your tail, a pretty stand further off. Behin enough after a little while of behin too. Stand farther. <laughs> Proceed. <laughs> Why? As I told thee, it is a custom in the afternoon with him to sleep. There thou mayst blame him, having first seized his books, or with a lag, butter his scalp, or oh, wow, punch him with a stake, or <laughs> cut his whistle with thy knife. Remember first to possess his books, for without them he is nothing but a sod as I, nor hath not one spirit to command. They all do hate him as rudely as I, burned by his books. And that most deeply to consider, is the beauty of his daughter, he himself, he himself calls her a non pareil. I never saw a woman but Sikorax, my dame, and she, and she as far surpasses Sikorax, as great does least. Is it so brave, alas? Yeah, yeah, she will become thy bed and bring thee forth brave brood. Monster, I will kill this man. <laughs> His daughter and I shall be king and queen, save our graces, and Trinculo and thyself shall be viceroys. <laughs> Dost thou like the plot, Trinculo? Excellent. <laughs> Give me thy hand. I am sorry I beat thee. But as thou livest, keep a good tongue in thy head. <laughs> ah, within this half an hour, he will be asleep. Wilt thou destroy him then? Aye, on mine honor. This will I tell my master. Oh, no, no. Thou makes me merry. I am full of pleasure. Mm. Will thou troll the catch that you told me but while there? At thy request, monster, I will do reason any reason. Come on, Trinculo, let us sing. Pull out, I'm in scout, 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 What is this, same? This is the tune of our cat, played by the picture of nobody! If thou beest a man, show thyself in thy likeness! If thou beest a devil, take it as thou list! Oh, my <laughs> he that dies pays all debts! I defy thee! <laughs> Mercy upon us! <laughs> Are thou a fear? No! <laughs> Monster, not I. <laughs> Be not a fear. The isle is full of noises, sounds, and sweet airs that give delight and heart not. Sometimes a thousand twangling instruments will hum about my ear, and sometimes voices that if I had then waked, after a long sleep would make me sleep again. And then, in dreaming, the clouds me thought would open and show riches ready to drop upon me, that if I waked, I cried to dream again. This shall prove a brave kingdom for me, where I shall have my music for nothing. <laughs> Ah, when Prospero is destroyed! That shall be, by and by, I remember the story. <laughs> the, the sound is going away. Let's follow it, and, and after do our work. Lead, monster, we'll follow. I would I could see this paper. He lays it on. We'll come, I'll follow Stefano! 